fast am I? Good evening and welcome to the Max Radio Folk Show with me, John Barker, playing you the best in folk and roots music from the Isle of Man and all around the world. And tonight's show is the Guitar Players Special, and I'm sure you've all realised by now that Richard Thompson is one of my guitar heroes. This is his song, Guitar Heroes. It's not very folky, but it sets the scene perfectly. And in it, you'll hear him impersonating Django Reinhardt, Les Paul, Chuck Berry, James Burton and Hank Marvin, some of his guitar heroes. My friends on a Saturday night My guitar's like a woman And you know I got to treat her right I've got to practice all night and day I've got to play the way my heroes play I've got to learn how to do it Django away Up later, let me practice if I choose. But how does Chuck Berry make it bounce right out of those grooves?
mom and dad say they're gonna put me out on the street I'm excommunicated till I get a job and get on my feet They say I'm not making a contribution But I'm still searching for a musical solution I've gotta know how the shadows get that beat That was Guitar Heroes by Richard Thompson. Some of his fantastic snarling electric guitar lead at the end there. Guitars, both electric and acoustic, are ubiquitous in folk music now. It's hard to imagine that they weren't really part of it until the folk revival of the 50s and 60s. One of the great innovators and first guitarists of that scene was Davy Graham, and his tune Angie has been covered by many. I think I first heard it by Paul Simon on one of the Simon and Godfunkel albums, but Bert Jansch is probably most famous for doing it. More of Bert later. This is the Davy Graham original, Angie.
That was Davy Graham with Angie from 1963. Coming much more up to date, Philip Henry is a fantastic guitarist. He's the guitarist in Edge Larks and also in Peter Knight's gig span, a big band. I've played you lots of music by them in the past. Phil has released a number of solo albums. The most recent is 2018's True North. It's a fantastic album. This is the first track from it, Little Bird, which is a Tim Eady tune, which I'm sure you'll recognise. <laughs> Wonderful Philip Henry playing his dobro with Little Bird written by Tim Eady. Hope to enjoy a beer or two with Phil when I go to Shrewsbury Folk Festival. He's playing there as part of Peter Knight's gig span, a big band. Now staying with slide guitar, Martin Simpson is one of the finest guitarists to come out of the folk scene through the 70s and 80s and very much up to the present day. We know him as one of the finest fingerstyle guitarists. He's also a great electric guitarist. Listen to his work with the Magpie Arc. But I think his slide guitar playing is really distinctive and fantastic thing. This is a song people might have heard me have a go at. It's Joe Bowers from his album Rooted from 2019. <laughs> And I had a brother Ike And I come from old Missouri Yes, all the way from Pike I tell you how I left there And 
how I come to roam and leave my dear old mother so far away from home. I used to have a girl there, and her name was Sally Black. And I asked her if she'd marry me. She said it was a whack. So she to me, Joe Bowers, before we hitch for life. You have to find a little home to keep your little wife. Oh, Sally, dearest Sally, oh Sally, for your sake, I will go to California and try to raise a stake. So she to me, Joe Bowers, now you're the man to win. Here's a kiss to bind the bargain, and she hugged a dozen in. California, I hadn't nary a red, and I had such wolfish feelings. I wished myself quite dead, but the thought of my dear Sally soon made them feelings get, and whispered hope to Bowers. I wish I had it yet. When first I come to mining, I put in my biggest licks, and I come down on the boulders just like a ton of bricks. I work both late and early in rain and sun and snow. I was working for my Sally. It was all the same to Joe. At length, I got a letter. It was from my brother Ike, and it come from old Missouri, yes, all the way from Pike. It had the damnedest news for me that I had ever read. It said Salad married the butcher, and the butcher's hair was red. I got another letter. It was from my brother Ike, and it come from old Missouri. Yes, all the way from Pike. It wasn't very newsy, but this is what it said. It said that Salad had a baby, and the baby's hair was red. Heard the story all about this sad affair, about Sal marrying the butcher and the baby having red hair. Whether it was a girl or a boy, a child, the letter never said. It only said the baby's hair was inclined to be red. Well, what about our Manx guitarist? We've got so many great guitarists here on the island. If I tried to list them all, I'd miss somebody out, and I wouldn't want to do that. For tonight's show, I'm going to play you a track from Mark Lawrence's Skillion E Guitar. This is Arani Clean and Aran Ben Villian. <laughs> Thank you. 
lovely playing of two Manx tunes there by Mark Lawrence. Now, going back to when I was a young lad many, many years ago, I discovered a Roy Harper LP, and I've been a fan ever since. I went to see his 70th birthday gig at the Royal Festival Hall in London, thinking it might be the last time I'd see him, but I've actually seen him twice since then. He's in his 80s now, and released one of his finest albums just about 10 years ago. But this is a song I've always loved. It's called South Africa, and in it, Roy addresses the country in the height of apartheid. And the dadgad guitar playing and the use of echoplex towards the end is something I've always enjoyed and strived to achieve. Once I was another's lover Now I am my own Trying to call myself a brother Living here alone Maybe if you came to see me Wishing I wasn't so blind Sitting here thinking to be Roy Harper with South Africa. He came up with the Les Cousins scene in London in the 1960s. So many great guitarists came through there, like Ralph McTell, John Martin, and of course Bert Jansch and John Renborn. Here those two are as part of Pentangle. This is Train Song from Basket of Light in 1969. <laughs> Thank you. 
sounded good with the headphones on. As I say, also in the Les Cousins scene, or Les Cousins as the coffee shop was originally called, but everyone just thought it was Les Cousins, was another of my favourites, John Martin. From his album Bless the Weather, this is the title track. Takes you away. Bless 
wonderful double bass playing on the pentangle track and that john martin track of course is by danny thompson let's have two instrumental tracks from two of the finest guitarists richard thompson again acoustic this time with banish misfortune and then martin carthy with molly oxford
I've just realised that all the guitarists I've played you so far have been from the Isle of Man, England, Scotland, Wales. So let's go over to the United States briefly. The guitarist in question here is David Rawlings. It's Gillian Welsh and David Rawlings from the fantastic Time, the Revelator album from 2001. This is I Just Want to Sing That Rock and Roll. If I'd made a show to include all of my favourite guitarists, it would probably be several hours long, so we can't do that tonight. Neil Young would be in there for his chaotic, noisy electric guitar playing, and the guitarist who played with Tom Waits for many years, Mark Ribot, would be in there too. As you may know, I play quite a lot of electric blues guitar, and the main influence on me there must have been Peter Green. So let's just go away from the folk briefly and play you this wonderful tune that I heard in the 60s and 70s and loved even then. It's Albatross by Fleetwood Mac. <laughs>
I still love that. Albatross by Fleetwood Mac, Peter Green, Danny Kerwin, Jeremy Spencer, three lead guitarists, all finding space for each other. So before the last track, I'll remind you of the sessions that are happening this week, O'Donnell's on Wednesday night, The Mitre on Friday night, and I think it'll be The Manor on Sunday afternoon. Don't forget you can get in touch via folkshow at manxradio.com and you can listen to this show again on the Max Radio website and as a podcast that you can download on Apple Podcasts, etc. Now, I realise this show has been dominated by bloke folk, shall we call it? So next week I'll make up for that. In the meantime, I make no excuses for the fact that I've played this song for you before. I think it's my favourite piece of acoustic folk guitar. It's Canadio by Nick Jones from Penguin Eggs. I'll see you next week. Sailor boy, and it's true that she loved him well. For to go off to sea with him, like she did not know how. She longed to see that seaport town called Kennedy Isle. She bargained with a young sailor boy It's all for a piece of gold Straightway then he led her All down into the hold Saying I'll dress you up in sailor's clothes Your jacket shall be blue You'll see that seaport town Kennedy Isle Now when the other sailors heard the news well, they fell into a rage And with all the whole ship's company They were willing to engage Saying Tie her hands and feed me, boys. Overboard, we'll throw her, and she'll never see that seaport town called Kennedy Isle. Now when the captain, he's heard the news Well, he too fell in a rage And with all of his whole ship's company He was willing to engage Saying she'll stay all in sailor's clothes Her collar shall be blue She'll see that seaport town Old Kennedy Isle Now when they came down to Canada Scarcely above half a year She's married this bold captain Who called her his dear 
in silks and satins now And she cuts a gallant show She's the finest of the ladies Down in Canada Isle Come all you fair and tender girls Wheresoever you may be I'd have you to follow your own true love When he goes out on the sea For if the sailors prove false to you Well, the captain, he might prove true You see the honor that I have got 